Hello, my friends from Cowell ECE. I'm so glad to see you. Today is Friday, March 27th. And we've already done a lot of colors on all the different days. So today we are celebrating Rainbow Day. And that means we're going to look for rainbows and for lots of colors around our houses. So I started looking around our house and I found a couple of rainbows. First, I found this blanket on my daughter Isabel's bed. Ta-da! That's a big, big rainbow on her blanket that keeps her cozy. Then I kept looking and I found a little ad address book and it sort of has a rainbow of stripes going on the side. I also found a box of sidewalk chalk that has all the colors of the rainbow in it that we're going to use to draw outside a little bit later. And then finally, I found something really cool, again, in Isabel's room. Look at this. It is a special music box that belongs to Isabel. It's got a big rainbow going over the top with um, a Pegasus horse with wings. You can see there's little secret drawers in this jewelry box of hers. Drawers in the front. And then when you open it up, there's also a surprise. Ready? And it's a Pegasus horse spinning around in circles. Pretty cool. So those were the rainbows I found. Maybe you'll find more rainbows around your house. I am going to read you a book today called Colors. We read this in our class before, so you might remember some of the pictures and some of the words. I hope you like it again. Colors by Shelley Rotner and Anne Woodhull with photos by Shelley Rotner. Colors. And here she put a beautiful photograph of all of these colorful flowers. Colors. And she started with a picture of all of these shoes of different colors that kids have. Colorful shoes. I also love this picture of the girl who has an umbrella that looks like a rainbow above her head. Green hops like a frog. Green grass, green peppers, leaves and peas, lizards and limes, green eyes. The cat has green eyes. Blue floats like this girl in the water. Blue boat, a wave, the ocean. Blue eggs, blueberries, right there. And blue jeans. Oh, and I forgot to say the sky too. <laughs> Yellow crunches like these dry leaves in fall. Ooh, look. Yellow slicker, which is a word for a raincoat. Sunflower. Sunny side up egg. I love this. It's called a sunny side up because it looks like the sun. A puppy. A pear, butter on corn, that looks yummy to me, and lemonade. Do you see the lemons in the lemonade? <laughs> oh, red races like this red fire truck. Oh my goodness, she's got all kinds of red fruits. Red strawberries, raspberries, apples, and cherries. A redhead, that's somebody who has red or orange hair. Red leaves, and a rose. 
And it's a pretty red flower. Orange glows like these pumpkins. These jack-o'-lanterns are glowing. Orange sunset fire. Popsicles, peaches, tangerines, a tiger. Is that a real tiger? No, that's someone with their face painted like a tiger. And a butterfly. <laughs> Purple blooms. Blooms means it's growing up like a flower. Purple iris. Oops, this one's iris. Pansies. Grapes and plums. A balloon. Can you see this boy blowing up a balloon? A backpack. Sneakers. It's another word for shoes. And a hat. White freezes like this ice. White sails on a sailboat. Milk, a waterfall, clouds, a swan down here. Snow, and ice cream. <laughs> and black shadows. So pretty. A black cat. I love that black cat. Blackberries. Black birds on a wire. A dog. Where's the dog? Oh, there he is. A turtle. Oh, we love turtles in our class. A horse. And the night. Hmm. What is your favorite color? We saw all of these beautiful things with beautiful colors in the book. And now you get to think, what's your favorite? And then they show a rainbow at the very end. So if you get the chance today, let me know what your favorite color is. And you can send me a picture of something in your favorite color if you would like to. All right, I'll talk to you soon. Bye guys.